Welcome to SEO Monitor, the first tool to accurately break down not provided data from Google Analytics and help you make smarter decisions for your business. Why is not provided data so important? People around the world are searching for solutions to their problems. Some of them already know you and are searching for your brand name, while others are searching for keywords that target their needs. But all these queries fall all together under not provided in Google Analytics. If you don't know which are the keywords that bring you customers, you cannot manage your SEO strategy. And you don't even know if it's your SEO campaign or your branding activities that are responsible for your performance. So you are losing valuable insights to grow your business. Once your Google Analytics and Webmaster Tools data have been processed, SEO Monitor will segment your brand and non-brand traffic and reveal all your keyword data and its performance. Now you know exactly the number of visits, transactions and revenue that each keyword brings to your business. You can check your site's performance historically for both your brand and non-brand traffic data. Now that you've seen how each keyword impacts your bottom end results, the next step is to build a strategy to grow your business. And the SEO campaign section is exactly what you need to do that. You can start by adding keywords to groups according to your own criteria. Priorities, opportunities, product categories, keywords related to a certain intent like cheap, price, online, or keywords related to a certain stage in the marketing funnel. We've automatically created a first group for you just to get you started. It's called SEO Opportunities. It includes relevant keywords that we've identified to have a high search volume and are easy to rank for. When you have hundreds of keywords, group monitoring comes in handy. You will know exactly which group is responsible for your SEO performance, and you can check all these metrics for each group. The broad organic visits metric you see here includes all the long tail keyword variations, which shows you the real impact that each group has on your business. At a keyword level, you will see the last day of the selected interval compared to the first day. You can sort and filter your keywords according to any metric you want, from rankings to visits, conversions, or even revenue. But let's look at two metrics that are crucial to your SEO strategy. The opportunity feature will show you which are the keywords most likely to bring the most revenue if your site ranked in top three. Smart, right? Opportunity levels range from one to 10, so you should look for full orange bullets. The second important metric is the difficulty level. It indicates just how difficult it will be for your site to rank for a certain keyword. Green means easy, red means difficult, very simple. Now you know how to prioritize and focus your resources on keywords that have a low degree of difficulty and high opportunity. Less resources spent for more revenue. You can download all this data for your custom reporting needs and even import new keywords you want to monitor. What happens if you have hundreds or even thousands of keywords that bring you traffic to your site? Some of the rankings are going up and some are going down. How can you understand if your SEO campaign is going in the right direction? This is why we created the Visibility Score, a metric that shows you how visible your site really is based on the rankings and search volume of your keyword list. A keyword with a high search volume that goes up in rankings will impact the visibility score more than a keyword with a lower search volume. Where organic traffic can be misleading, visibility score is a great metric to measure your SEO efforts regardless of the seasonality. Now, one of the most appreciated features is the Competition Insights section, where you can compare your website performance against any competitor. We will automatically suggest to you the top five most visible websites for your keyword list, but you can choose to analyze any website if it feels right for you. We already monitor them all. You can add up to four competitors at once to compare results based on visibility score, visits and rankings. You can choose to analyze your results globally or at a group level in case you have different competitors for different products or services. And finally, the cherry on top is a search reputation section that allows you to monitor the results that Google indexes for your brand keywords. This is an excellent tool to track your reputation in Google, which can be critical if you have negative results. The number of estimated impressions, website authority and sentiment help you understand the impact that each result has on your business. Of course, there's more to SEO Monitor, but for now, this is about everything you need to know to get you started. I hope you've enjoyed this tool. In the following days, we'll be sending you some great tips on how to make the most of SEO Monitor. So watch that inbox.